All right, everybody, we are checking out the brand new update. Metal Sonic is back. He kidnapped my family. We're about to have a good old-fashioned CSDG Classic Sonic Drip Gang. Drippiest people out. Versus MSDG Metal Sonic Drip Gang. Let me know which one you guys are down below in the comments. But before we do that, I need you guys to subscribe to the channel with all notifications and hit the like button right now. I'll give you a second to do that. And hopefully you guys have on notifications. Also, as usual, we'll be running a Robux giveaway because, listen, I don't play Roblox, so I'll give you guys the Robux. I don't need them. So, if you guys want to win, guys, click on this video right here. Sonic 1 versus Sonic 2, but if I touch rings, the video or the game swaps. Watch it in full. Drop a like. Drop a nice comment on it. And then come back here and comment your Roblox name. Let me know you've done all the steps. And stay tuned throughout the week. I'll be posting mainline Sonic videos. I'll drop a pinned comment saying the winner, but you have to reply to that comment to win. So you're gonna have to tune into all the mainline Sonic videos. But with that being said, let's get into the uh, let's get into the showcase. Support the real content. Support the good stuff. Let's get into it. All right, what do we got? So Hollow Metal Sonic has actually returned. Wow, that's pretty crazy. So he's back. So you have a chance to get Chrome Metal Sonic as well as Hollow Metal Sonic. Whoa! Eggman, an actual Eggman model is in the game, bro. What? Yo, I'm standing on top of his head, bro. Look at this. No way. Eggman's actually in the game, dude. Hold on. I'm gonna switch to Classic Sonic real quick. No way. He's actually in the game. I'm standing on top of Eggman's head. Yo, that means. Yo, why is he so tall? My boy, yo, he should play for like. He should play for the Denver Nuggets. He should replace Nikola Jokic and and play for the Denver Nuggets. Anyways, all right. So, look. There's a new Knuckles bundle on sale. Pretty cool. Uh, Metal Sonic Chow is a paid Robux Chow indeed. Um, I'm not really not really too high in the stats. Chrome Tornado is back. We will definitely be purchasing this. I'm not going to do it in the test servers. 50% faster, so I will be purchasing that. Chrome Metal Sonic Chow is wow. Wow. I will be purchasing this. This is really good. I'm going to be buying these for Robux. Damn. All right. Anyways. So, yeah, that's the sale. And Eggman's now in the game. Very cool. Very cool. So, guys, I believe Metal Madness is back. It's a race, guys. So everyone, you're going to have to pick the Metal Madness race. In order to unlock Metal Sonic, we have a couple of different quests. Obviously, the uh, quest text is not final. If you guys want to check that out, you can check it out. All right. You need to boost for 300 seconds in a race. You need to rail grind. You need to complete 15 races. And you need to collect Mysterious Orb. So why don't we show you guys the fastest way to do that. As always, just so you guys are, are aware... You, right, we have three racetracks now in the game. This is already a, a W update. Metal Madness Race has returned. So, guys, remember for this, you're going to want to vote for the Metal Madness Race. But there's a bunch of other stuff you might want to uh, look at doing as well. So, guys, with that being said, let's get into the uh, the race. Metal Madness, the best Sonic Speed Simulator update ever, has returned. And we got to check it out. MSDG versus CSDG on freaking Stardust Speedway. Metal Sonic has appeared. Nice. He's back. He kidnapped my family. We got to see how this functions, man. I wonder if they had um, improved anything. You know what I mean? I wonder if they have improved the uh, the meshes, the textures. All right, let's see. Oh, my God. Racing in Metal Madness, bro. It's crazy because I remember I originally said when this first came out, I'm like, yo, we need to be able to race on Stardust Speedway. Well, guys, we can now officially race on Stardust Speedway, actually. If you guys don't know how to play this map, if you haven't been playing, paying attention to the... Uh, um, if you haven't been playing, oh my god, I just fell. Either way, we have to grind anyway. So look, you're going to want to take the lower path to hit the grind rail points section. Uh, but remember, guys, it's important to go over here. Uh, we're not going to make that jump. That used so all right, I'm going to show you guys the fastest route, but oh my god, we can officially race and start a speedway. Remember, you have to watch out for that, um, for that purple energy right there. You got to watch out for it, man. You got to watch out for it. It's pretty crazy stuff right there. Wow, I, I don't think there's much different. Maybe they made the map a little bit bigger to accommodate for the... Uh... Wow, and you make it to the end, bro. So nostalgic, man. That was the best update ever in Sonic Speed Simulator history, man. That really was. And now, this, I would say the series of racing updates is truly the actual best Sonic Speed Simulator update in history. Let's see how, how, uh, how much we progressed. So you have to do this race 15 times. You got to get a lot of grind rail points, so... I'll show you guys the fastest way how to do this, but man, I'm already super impressed so far. By the way, guys, brand new feature that you guys didn't know about. If you press C, you can now quickly swap over to your hoverboard and quickly hop off of it. So now, 
Uh, you have to be, you have to be, you have to be uh, on the ground. But now you can switch to your hoverboard. And I'll tell you about the tornado in a second. But we got another race coming up. By the way, for boost time in races, you can actually boost in the uh, pre-lobby area. You'll get a couple extra seconds, which could shave a race or two off, I believe, by doing this. But guys, we're racing in the great. Yeah, like. I have so many memories, so many videos with this Metal Madness racetrack. I mean, I'm just so happy. Look at this, guys. Look at that. Boom. Boom. All right, you're going you're gonna to want to go... Oh, God, we just fell. That's okay. We, we want to collect more orbs anyway. So, yeah, I would say typically the fastest way to do it is to take the upper path right here. That's the fastest way to do it. But if you're going for just grind rail points, which you probably should be doing for the sake of completing the event, you're going to want to do it down here. You know what I'm saying? Very simple, very easy. We're going to see if we can boost off of this. Uh, can we boost off of this? Yeah, I don't think you can do the, the old boost across the, uh, the map like you used to be able to. But this is still fun, man. People, people who remember how to do this map are gonna, are gonna have a really good time with this. They're gonna be, it's gonna be very easy for them. But, very impressive, guys. Very impressive. The devs, again, it, so, I, I said, I'm like, yo, I want Emerald Coast, City Escape, and Metal Madness in this game, and Hoverboard Races, those are the four things I asked for, and they made it into the game. Maybe, maybe the devs have been watching my videos. I'm just kidding. But no, nah, it's true, though. Those, those are the four things I asked for, and they're in the game now. So, very impressed with that. And, uh, by the way, I forgot to show you guys. If you press V, you can quickly hop into your tornado. So, now, you can, if, on the keyboard, on mouse and keyboard. I don't know what the command for it is on controller. Uh, let, let me check and see what it is on controller. On controller... It's the D-pad right. We'll get you on your. Uh, we'll get you on the tornado faster and dismount. You can't mount in midair, unfortunately, but that's okay. And then you can still do it if you uh, if you click. Interesting. Okay, you can do it if you click. You can't do it on controller. You you can dismount on controller. But yeah, guys. And then to do hoverboard on controller, you press left on the D-pad. Quickly switch to your mount without having to click or anything like that. That's a pretty useful feature. I do enjoy that. So that's a, something that I wanted you guys to know about. Very useful feature. The quality of life is improving. The content is improving. I got to say, I'm really I'm really happy with SSS right now. I, I, I will say that. All right, fellas. Yo, look at all these people here. We got another race. Here we go. Here we freaking go. So yeah, fastest way, obviously, is make sure to hit these things. Make sure you're boosting. This was the old way to beat it, you know? Oh, we just went through that. You would cut through here. Bro, I remember they used to have speed capless glitches. Man, this is crazy. But remember, you're not going to want to go up here. Uh, if you're trying to do it fast, go up there. But if you're trying to get the grind rail points, you have to do this. You got to go right here. You could just theoretically spam this, but you got you to gotta win the race 15 times. So I don't think it really matters. Let's see if we can... Oh, God. Hello. Hello. Ready? But yeah, I'm really impressed with this, guys. I hope you guys r recognize it. This is probably one of the best updates ever. It's got it. I mean, the, the last couple series of updates, a new racetrack once a week. We've got a new racetrack once a week for the last, like, three weeks. Like, this is wild, bro. This is actually crazy, man. I can't believe this is, the, like, the dream SSS. But I think the last frontier for SSS is getting, like, competitive matchmaking or, like, seasons or, like, battle pass type rewards. Not in, like, that type of way. It doesn't have to be pay to win type stuff. But I think that's, like, I think that's the final, uh, I think that would be, like, Ma I think matchmaking would truly be like pretty crazy because it's it's more exhibition right now. It feels like it's more exhibition based as opposed to like here's the matchmaking system. But I like it. I mean, listen, they, like I said before, they don't have to make another change to races and I'm good with it. But that's just my little two cents. But I, yo, basically, essentially, essentially, sorry, you're going to want to rinse and repeat those steps and then you will unlock Metal Sonic. That's all you got to do. All right, we got another race. What is everyone doing? Oh my God, thank you for this $1 super chat. Everybody spam W. Hey, Sonica, wait. Oh, these guys want to race? Look at this. Yo, this is my dream come true for SSS. I feel like it's really coming in full circle, though. Getting this race, racetrack of Metal Madness. Like, who would have thought, man? Who would have freaking thought, dude? Like, so many videos, so many memories, man. This is like, this is, this is nostalgic, man. This is like, they're blending in 1.0 and 2.0 together, man. Look at that. All right, so yeah, grind on this rail right here. You got to take that that little trail right there also you're gonna want to jump through right here so you get more orbs um yeah get more orbs remember avoid the ping things they're gonna knock you back they don't actually kill you anymore they actually knock you back but yeah i mean follow these steps and this is what you're gonna have to do to unlock metal sonic let me know what you guys think about this update personally i think it's a massive major big fat w but you guys let me know down below in the comments and make sure to watch some of those other Sonic videos. But yeah, guys, let's go show off the skin for you guys. 
Also, I will do a little showcase because normally, uh, lately I haven't been unlocking the skins. We'll do a showcase real quick. So yeah, guys, here is Metal Sonic. It's nice to see also that they're giving a lot, a lot of old characters are getting a nice rerun. We got Jet last week, Pro Metal Sonic. Is, well, like, it seems like we're getting a lot of reruns. They're, the devs are allowing players to unlock those characters for free that otherwise you would not be able to unlock. Right now, if you are a brand new player playing Sonic Speed Simulator, there's really not a better time to get into this game. Like, a lot of these updates are phenomenal. This is the perfect time for people to get into the game. There's so many skins and characters to unlock. There's so much content for new players. So, yeah, guys, that is the Metal Sonic update. The rerun, I can only imagine. I can I, I can only hope to see what comes next week because I'm super excited about it, man. But, yeah, Metal Sonic, let's take a look at him. Look at that, man, bro. And they put Eggman in the game, so that's pretty cool.